In Long Beach, today, over a thousand home and property owners are making extra money by providing short-term rentals through online services like Airbnb and VRBO. And while room rentals have always been allowed, these new short-term rentals or vacation rentals are quite different since the owner of the unit doesn't have to be on the premise during the rental time. That's one of the reasons the city decided it was time to come up with regulations for an ordinance, a city law that would address the key concerns of both owners and neighbors. Tonight, we are talking to the community about some preliminary options for short-term rental regulation in Long Beach. Short-term rentals is an issue that affects our entire city, uh, from landlords to renters to homeowners, and so we wanted to make sure we had a process that was inclusive of everybody. Based on careful research and community feedback, the city has now developed three rental options for further analysis and consideration. Each option would require owner registration and payment of transient occupancy taxes, or also known as hotel taxes. One option is to require city registration for each short-term rental, payment of transient occupancy taxes, and providing a local 24-hour contact for the rental. Option two would allow up to two rental units per resident, or up to three if one of those units is your primary home. Now option three adds an additional layer of restriction, which would allow unhosted short-term rentals, so where a resident is not on the property, to be prohibited in certain areas utilizing a petition type process with the residents. Now, based on further community input, these options are being refined and will be presented to the City Council so an ordinance can be written and adopted. To find out more about this, visit the Short-Term Rental Projects website.